Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. Today I wanna to talk to you guys about harm reduction strategies that you can do in order to reduce negative effects that things can have on you. For example, cigarette smoking. Obviously we know that there's some negative effects and harm that it can cause you. Marijuana smoking, you know, drugs, whether they're illegal or legal drugs. I mean, pharmaceutical drugs and the negative side effects that those can have on you also. Or even just chemicals or different things in our environment, stuff in our air, stuff in our water, stuff in our food, guys. This stuff is pretty much everywhere. And so one thing that can protect you and so that you can detox properly and really have a protective mechanism uh, that it has on our body is hydrogen. Let me just share one or a few studies about cigarettes or in particular cigarette smoke. This is really interesting because I've had people contact me who have told me, you know, I smoke cigarettes, but I still want to be as healthy as I can. I'm having a hard time kicking the habit. Obviously, I think, I think hydrogen would be great as a protective mechanism or somebody who enjoys drinking. Even if you don't drink much, let's say you have a little bit of wine or you want to have a beer once in a while, I would definitely recommend pairing it with hydrogen water, something of that nature. So here we go, let me share some of the research because it's really interesting. Basically, they had some rats and they were showing that the cigarette smoke would give them emphysema. No surprise there, right? Well, they were giving them hydrogen water and then they would expose them to the cigarette smoke and guess what? It appeared that the hydrogen was actually preventing pulmonary emphysema. That was crazy, so that was pretty cool. Here's another one for anybody who wants a baby or is trying to get somebody pregnant or become pregnant. They do use hydrogen for that actually in Japan. Well, here's the interesting research study. When they exposed mice or these rats to cigarette smoke, it showed that it would lower their testosterone levels, increase abnormalities in their sperm, it would actually decrease the sperm count also, and it would also have certain effects on their sex hormones, like certain imbalances. So that was all very interesting. But it got more interesting when they exposed them to hydrogen because they would do that, and then they found that it would increase the testosterone, it would increase their sperm count, it would lower the amount of abnormalities or deformations that they had in their sperm, and it would, was able to balance these sex hormones and basically the overall quality of their sperm. So this particular study was for the male rats, obviously. But this was all very interesting. Hydrogen always seems to have this protective mechanism. It's not just with cigarettes and this, and, and this particular study in regards to uh, the reproductive systems of rats. I've seen this with other things also. And I'm sure there's gonna be more research coming out, but I think the simple fact is there is a protective mechanism. I mean, this is really what antioxidants do for, any, for us anyway. They really help us protect, but hydrogen seems to go above and beyond. It seems to do something special in regards to protecting us. And so if our sperm count is gonna be affected by alcohol, or if it's gonna be affected by marijuana, or if it's gonna be affected by different chemicals or even certain pharmaceuticals, it really looks like hydrogen might have a really good protective mechanism or at least harm reduction effect on our bodies. So I wanted to make the video because, you know, check it out too guys, I'll share this with you, it's kind of funny, but I went to the store and look what I found, this wine, it says uprising. So <laughs> I had to pick it up and it was actually pretty good. Um, and so anyway, I thought I'd share that with you guys because I thought it was kind of funny. Um, but yeah, you know, I'm, I enjoy having a little wine with dinner and things like that. And I know that I'm exposed to certain things, believe it or not, even when you take a shower, your skin is the largest organ of the human body and you're exposed to things even in the shower. There's so many things that we're exposed to, like it or not, it's just the way it is. So anything we can do to protect ourselves. I mean, we got an ozone layer that is not what it used to be. And there has been research showing how hydrogen protects us from radiation. Heck, they use it for cancer patients who are undergoing chemotherapy because of the protective mechanism, me mechanism. Um, from radiation and of course NASA is even contemplating using it because their astronauts get exposed to a lot of radiation and so they want to use hydrogen for that too so hydrogen has just this awesome protective effect I think it's really awesome and it's really easy and it's really simple and even if somebody just wants a detox just something like that Hydrogen appears to have a really great effect on that also. And it's important for us to be able to detox in order to stay healthy. Our body's doing it all the time. So I wanted to make this video to put out this information for those people who had emailed me and also just for those of you out there who may have not known how hydrogen can really benefit you. If you found this video helpful, guys, give it a thumbs up as that also helps the channel. And don't forget to subscribe because I got some new videos that are going to be coming out. They're going to be really, really great. I'm putting them all in the works right now and it's just taking some time. And that's it. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time on the next one.